Hello again. Hello again. That was a weird one. Sorry. It's been a while since I've said the line. That's not true, actually. I recorded something yesterday. Hello again. There we go. That was more like it. Um, I'm just quickly... Um, I thought I would start the stream. We might as well do this together. Hello. 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 <laughs> Ad, really? <laughs> I don't think you should get one. They're not automatic, but you know, I guess it, it plays one before the uh, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. You know what I mean. Uh, I'm just doing um, I'm doing alert sounds because we've all been very annoyed by repetitive orgasmatrons. You know how it goes. So um. Uh, I should probably just uh, link the stream in my Discord as well. Sorry, VOD watchers, this is not fun for you, I know. I know, it's so hard. It's so hard for you VOD watchers. <clears throat> Sorry, I, I just ate dinner as well, so I might have a little bit of something in my voice. Everyone. <laughs> Link them all. Robits. Wow, very cool. Uh, how are you all? Is everybody good? Good morning, says someone. Ah, don't be silly, it's five in the afternoon. How do you skip this part? You can't do that, I'm afraid. <clears throat> yeah, so... Uh, that's a pretty good one. No idea how loud that is for you guys right now. I just got, you know, all of the sound effects from uh, Diablo 2, and I was just looking for something for a donation alert. And I think that that little clink of some coins uh, is probably pretty good. If I just export that right quick, I'll upload it, and then we can start actually doing the thing that you're all here for. I'm going to be honest. I was meant to do this before the stream started, and I just didn't. So, uh, you know, it is, and now you guys are just stuck here for it. That's, uh, that's really all there is to it. Nothing more, nothing less. All right. I also can't read chat right now, so I have no idea what you guys are up to. <clears throat> Azor, can you buy me a pizza? No, no, you misunderstand. It goes the other way around. You guys give me money. Uh, <laughs> or don't, as the case may be. That's also very fine. Uh, I don't want to drag and drop upload, thank you. That sounds good to me. So whenever I get given money now, uh, let me just do it for the members as well. No more Orgasmatron. Orgasmatron is dead. The king is dead. Long live the king. Ten dollars from Signing Mantis. Thank you. Oh wait, did I save it in time? I wonder. We'll find out. Any day now. <laughs> what a rush! If this isn't content, I don't know what is. Alright, um... Very good. Oh, thank you for giving me some dosh as well, Mr. Maradoc. Mmm, feeling the Christmas cheer already! <sighs> Okay, right, as we know anyway, Streamlabs is way behind, so eventually we either will or won't hear a clanking sound. We'll see. No big deal. Let's actually do some stuff. And Noah's here to test the donation sound. The membership sounds, rather. Of course, very good. Oh, wait, that didn't make a sound. <laughs> Uh-oh. 
Or at least I didn't hear it. Orgasmatron. Oh, God damn it! I heard Orgasmatron. The king is not dead. <laughs> Throw a test one through. Oh, okay, so the test worked. That one wasn't real, by the way. Oh, that one. Okay, I think it's updated now. I think it just hadn't updated yet. Oh, unless the super chats... Oh, super chats are a different one. Okay, hang on. That's why. I can just change that to that. Save settings. Okay, everything should now be clink instead of orgasmatron. Thank you all for the money. So very kind. Too kind, some would say. Um... But not me. All right. <clears throat> right. So w what we're intending to do today at the robot farm, if I, f if I remember, I will cut all of that from the VOD. Oh, I defiled sorrow with $10 as well. Stop giving me money, guys. I know it's Christmas, but... Um, right, we have the music turned off right now, is what we have. Let me just... Oh yes, with a nice fade in. A good fade it fade in. We love that. That's what we like to hear and see and smell. Pizza party at Hazel's flat. Bitch, please. I live in a house. What do you think this is? <laughs> Alright, hopefully that clank isn't too loud. Let me know. Let me know if it's too loud. Okay. As always, let me know if anything's too loud or not too loud. I'm not getting a pizza anyway, I've, uh... You assume all YouTubers are broke? Poof. Interesting, but okay. A British person with his own house? I don't own it, I just live in it. <laughs> Clank is not loud enough, do you think, really? I mean, I don't want it to be loud is the thing, you see. I want it to be quite quiet. The Orgasmatron was too loud, but I suppose I can probably have a slightly louder Clanky Clanky. Oh, dearie, dearie, dearie. Okay, so, uh, yes, we, to, to recap quickly. We are androids living in our little compound, which is incredibly human. The design is very human. I'm not going to lie, I had to mute the microphone there because it was burping time. Merry Christmas, buy some tea. Thanks, Ducky Tim. Oh God, thanks, uh, Miss Knight as well for ten dollars. You guys, defiled sorrow, five dollars. Oh, guys, come on now. Um, <laughs> buy yourself something nice. I already bought myself something nice. I have a mattress. I got a new mattress yesterday. Let me tell you, if you've had a mattress for thirteen years and can afford it, buy a new mattress. <laughs> makes a big difference. Now, to recap, we're androids, we want to kill the humans. If we look on the world map, if we zoom out and look on the world map, there's all of these things here. Look at this stuff. Look at all these things. These are all full of humans. Fleshy biological humans. And I would like for there to be less of them. That one's actually not fleshy biological humans. That's robots. Uh, more robots. The, yeah, the, these are all robots. We, we'll get, we'll, we'll deal with those too, I guess. But we gotta, we gotta, we gotta deal with those humans. And the best way to deal with those humans, I suspect, is with more androids. So we built Mr. Wrench and Mr. Numbers last episode. Um, and have not used them yet. We haven't used them yet, have we? Sorry, my brain froze for a moment there. My brain will do a lot of that right now. I'm, um, I have a confession to make, guys. I've been playing a lot of Path of Exile. Um, it's a sickness. And I love it. It's a sickness and baby, I'm infected. Um, so, so very infected. 
but it's affecting my brain and my ability to think about anything else. Uh, Ian Nicholson asks, what contributes a human farm? Humans grow in here and they go into this meat grinder. I think that's pretty much the, uh, the ins and outs of farming, agriculture, livestock agriculture, livestock processing. Um, and then we're turning them into nutriamine specifically because we need nutriamine to make lubricant and coolant to fuel our android bodies. Our big meaty android bodies. All right, yeah, we're hemmed in by charge blaster at the moment. I remember that now. So I made a zone called don't piss off the robots, right? Yeah, don't piss off the robots. Is it just this one at the moment? Yeah, it's just that one. Okay. Okay, right. Um, a lot of people don't have anything to do, and by people I mean androids, <laughs> Freudian slip. A lot of the androids don't have anything to do, and that's okay. Um, I, I'm going to be building more of them than I need to actually just day-to-day -day run this colony. Um, that's no big deal. Um, I need to think about how we're going to actually do conquest now. Um... And we have the toad, which is a big drop pod that we can put, I believe, nine people in. Robots. Robots, not people. Uh, oh no, only four. Okay. Which is a lot of robots if you give them machine guns, don't get me wrong. Um, but I think we could probably do better with a... Uh, a combat vehicle that actually has a gun on it. But I don't want to use... I don't really want to. I could, but I don't really want to use something with mounted weaponry just because it's really, really overpowered. Honestly. Um, it looks like this mod has been updated. Siege pods. Learn to build more powerful siege pods that act as temporary moving bases during assault. Jesus. Yeah, there's some stuff's been added to this since I last played it. Um, but yeah, the, when I use them, honestly, they're too too kind of overpowered. Uh, the gunning down all kinds of things because the enemies don't have vehicles. Look, if the, when this mod eventually gets updated so that other other people can have uh, vehicles, this will be considerably more fun and balanced. But for now, I don't really want to just roll around destroying everything with with mounted weaponry. It's not it's not super fun. Um, so we'll probably just use the toad and drop pod onto people and gun them down, you know, for now. So with that in mind, let's make two more tier one androids to go alongside wrench and numbers. <laughs> I think I'm a bob. Am I excited for Christmas? I mean, I don't know. I don't really... Unfortunately, I'm not really a, a big Christmas person. Um, I, I mean, that's not unfortunate, right? It's a consumerist hell, but... I, uh, I, I go and see my family. I enjoy it well enough. That's about the extent of it. Um... Is there anything I actually need to make these guys? We're making all of our stuff, right? Let's get this open. I don't have any regular components right now, and I don't have any steel either. Right, that's the predicament I left myself in. I'm sure of it. <laughs> I remember finishing the last stream and being like, ah, this is a problem for future Harry, and I think this must be the problem for future Harry that I was talking about, this defoliator ship here. Um... Yes, I'm running all DLCs. Right. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. So, <laughs> I've got... <laughs> a small problem here. Did we, uh, we... We built this artillery... But we almost certainly can't afford to make any shells for that. No, because it takes 
a load of steel. If I had a heavy barrel... Okay, yes, I now remember exactly where I left the last stream. Saying, if only I had a heavy barrel. <laughs> that is what I... That is where the last stream ended, with me saying, sure could use a heavy barrel. All right, so let's deconstruct those ship chunks. That'll be handy. Um, we can go around to that one as well, so long as nobody... Well, let, let's be safe and not go get that one. But um, just take Beeper off of his zone restriction. Well, should we use Beeper? No, let's, uh, let's do Bob. Bob's the builder, after all. Silly Sausage is creatively inspired. You'd love to see it. You'd love to see it. This new video is good. Thank you, DY Duck. I appreciate that. Um, I'll definitely do another. It's a very fun video to make. Quite um, easy to farm you guys for, for ideas like that. Come on, Bob. Get to it. Go, go, go. If Yeo has no crafting, could you make a drug empire with the bots? Um, it has an intelligence requirement, though, so they would have to be... You can only make them with tier 2 robots. I think we discovered this last time. That Because the tier 1 robots have no intellectual skills, so they can't... Um, they can't do it. I think that's what um, Silly Sausage does. Yeah, Silly Sausage is the person that does the intellectual work around here. Accurate Bean Man, do I have another job other than being a YouTuber? No, I, this is this is it. As of earlier this year, I went full time. Seems like it's a very low effort. I mean, hang on, let's not let's not go so far as to say low effort. <laughs> it's lower effort. Okay, well, they're manhunting hair. That's fine. Don't piss off the mechanoids. Oh, shit. What are we shooting? And why why was Bob out there in the first place? Oh, these, I don't have time for these questions. He didn't get killed. I don't know what happened there. What are you doing, Bob? Why can he go? Oh, right, because don't piss off the robots. Doesn't include, doesn't have anything including to blah, 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 blah. for this. Right, got it, got it, got you. Who? Wait, what? ah, beans. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right, that's why everybody else was on stay inside. Uh, Bob. Oh, Bob. Poor Bob. Poor Bob. Well, you ain't bleeding out, but let's get you, uh... Let's get you repaired. Poor Bob! Yeah, I forgot there's another really annoying cluster up here with a load of wee little guns. A load of wee little guns indeed. Expand area one to include this temple that we had to make because we have three semi-intelligent robots now. Um. Hmm. We we just need a heavy barrel. Let's uh, let's do some some sky trading. Uh, do we have anything valuable and or just shitloads of silver? Uh, well, we've got lots of wood. We can turn that into beds. <laughs> That's quite valuable. Um. Other than that, though, not so sure. Oh, that's the medical bed. I see. Very good. Very good. I remember last time there was some weirdness about the coolant and lubricant situation as well, but I think it's fine. 
Um, human skin is valuable, yes, but none of those are actually making it here right now on account of the mech clusters. So we need to trade some stuff. I mean, I have a very small quantity of Yeo. We can load some stuff on. Uh, we could sell some chem fuel even if we have to. Um, take the 43 silver with you. I mean, a, a heavy barrel is usually only like 300 and something silver anyway, right? Take some jade, I guess. I don't know. That's pretty valuable stuff. It's either that or use it to make statues, I think. Nutre means pretty valuable too, and we have a basically infinite supply of that, so... Stick it in there, honey. Jellied chem fuel and Prometheum also pretty good. I don't plan on using it myself. Robots with flamethrowers is, um... I don't know if I want to go that route. Did you have to make a deal with an eldritch being to maintain a soothing voice and produce fantastic content? Nope. It's just... Raw talent, baby! <laughs> uh, no. Um, gross. Uh, right, who is going trading? I actually think I remember Silly Sausage having a higher social skill. No, I was wrong. Looks like it's Beeper then. Yeah, it's Beeper. Hey Beeper, where are you at? He's, he's praying. Get in the goddamn frog, Beeper. You're going trading. Um, presumably... Wait, is it fully fueled? Wow, it doesn't have a very long range. Is it being nerfed? Well, uh, go here then and see what they... See whether or not they have a heavy thingy what's it. Do you guys have a heavy barrel, perchance? They do! 800 silver? Goodness gracious me. Why? That's gonna cause us a problem. No, it's not. We've still got the chem fuel. Oh, so close yet so far. Okay, we'll have to... We'll have to pawn some more shit. <laughs> Can you haggle for it? Beeper, come on. Alright, we'll find something. Can't click on Beeper because of notifications. There we go. Alright, what else can we stick in here? <laughs> what else can we yeet at them? Let's just... Uh, some more jade. That'll do it. Some more jade in this weird plain leather. It's leather made of animals that aren't humans. I don't really get it. Uh, will this be a full vid or just a stream thing? Just a stream thing. I don't... I was trying to get these um these edited, but uh, because in my first couple of streams... uh, Well, in all of them, having the game music on is, is fucky for one, and also I don't have like, split audio channels and stuff. It's basically just a nightmare, so these are probably... Probably not actually going to get edited. Which is mainly my bad, but uh, it's fine. It is what it is. I know now to do better next time I do a streamed series. Where's Beeper gone? There he is. Alright, you're going back. Um, and I couldn't personally edit this into a normal video because I'm not making any notes or anything while I play, so... Um, it would just be hell. I can't subject myself to that. I've got other stuff to do, you know. Right, we got the reinforced barrel that we need to make a regular small mortar. Which lives there. Um. Cannot be placed under a roof. We'll get rid of the peak. Get rid of the roof then. 
Oh, I'm gonna sneeze. I muted it in time. Assassin robots, blood and cheese, IG units from Star Wars. Come on now. Star Wars? It's just like space cape shit. Um, why can't I build it there? Oh, that's the artillery's interaction spot, I see. Oh, whatever, just put it there then. Uh, we do need some steel though, don't we? Um, yeah, that's going to be a problem. So let's just suspend the component job, because I think we've actually just lost some steel to crafting components, my bad. Um... Have I played the mod that lets me live in a starship? Spaceship, rather. Um, save our ship. Yes, I have. I didn't love it. Um, I'll revisit it someday. But not today. <laughs> one of these days, but certainly not this one. Uh, okay, right, we're going to have to trade for some bloody steel now, aren't we? Ah, oh, what a nightmare. And then we realistically does it does anybody have I can't remember whether or not I made any Okay, yeah. Silly sausage has binoculars already. Very good. Um Right. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, we've got psychoid leaves, so we'll be able to buy some steel with the Yayo. The resultant Yayo. Shouldn't those psychoid leaves be stored here? Set that to critical. Thank you. It's more like it. Uh, beeper. Yayo in there. Where's Beeper? Where is he? Beeper. You're needed. In the trading. Um, load what silver I've already got as well, please. Uh, hey guys. It's us again. It's us robots back again. You got some steel? <laughs> yeah, they do. Very good. Okay, so uh, we need 50. We can afford 50. God, only just though. That's brutal. And back home. Simple. Right, now before anybody gets any ideas as to what to do with that steel. Where's it gone? Rat Slayer's unloading it. Wait, how's it become 42 steel? What's happened? <laughs> Has somebody started using it immediately for something? Huh? Didn't I buy 50? Where did it go? <laughs> Re. Is it still in someone's inventory? Ratslayer, are you not finished? Where did it go? Did somebody just steal it from- what happened? I'm genuinely confused. It must have just been used for something really quickly the moment he arrived, like ammo or something. Where even is my loading bench? Oh, there it is. Yeah, I bet it was used for ammo. God damn it. I definitely bought 50. I typed five zero. Um, you only picked up 42 due to the price? I don't believe you. I don't believe you. I think you're lying to me. You guys are gaslighting me. 
But I came back with silver, so that can't be correct. You guys are definitely gaslighting me. Because I brought 302 silver back with me, so you're gaslighting me. Stop gaslighting me. Wait, what if they only had 42? Let's find out. Beeper, guess what? You're going flying again. You love flying, Beeper, don't you? That's right, you sure do. Okay, let's try that again. You know what, this time I'm buying a hundred. And ten, just in case. Just in case I get robbed again. Maybe Beeper had to use some of it for, I don't know, some kind of preventative maintenance on the frog. There you go, 110 steel. What are you going to do with that dev mode? Where are you going with that steel right now, huh? That's right. That's what I thought. Okay, electronics fabrication factory. That's very good. So what, I, what we were doing here, I also now remember this, is that we are researching the things that we need to be able to... Um, in fact, I think that was the last thing we needed to be able to extract uh, loads of steel from the ground. But we gonna need a lot more advanced components of steel and such to do that in the first place. So we have to free ourselves from this um, hell first. Mechanite assisted recovery. Um, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. What are we researching? Ground penetrating scanner, I guess, wouldn't be a bad idea, all things considered. Right, let's try and deal with some robots then. So, I'm just for no reason at all going to make a save titled Scum right here um, and send Silly Sausage out to see if they can see anything interesting. Can they take return fire here? Sure looks like they can. Let's um let's let's not go there then on second thoughts. No 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 don't go that way. What do these guys range look like? Ah, okay, perfect. So if you just go over there. Plim plom plin. Uh wait, actually. Silly sausage has terrible shooting skill. Drop the binoculars, sausage. Um, who has better? Bob's pretty good at it. Hello, Epsilon. Hello, Branwy. Etc, etc. Hello, hello, hello. No, don't go that way, Bob. That's how you get shot. Again. And then we'll just sit a beeper on the mortar. I don't know why I'm saying beeper like that. I just can't, you know. Why not? Don't shoot yet. No, no, no. Bob's moving kind of slow. Is that just how fast he goes? I guess. He's snowy. Right. Can anybody shoot at you here, Bob? Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's uh, target these. Bob will now mark the target, very good, for Beeper to give this his best try. Now Beeper, remember, we don't have a lot of materials. Oh, good job. All right, next. Bob's doing his stuff. Yeah, this is the perfect music to yeet at- no. No. Bad beeper. Aim at this. Damn it, he already shot it. Oh no, he didn't. Okay. Good boy. Good, good beeper. Never mind. Bad beeper. You know what? You know what? 
Hold fire. We're going to aim at the cluster of them instead. We can handle one or two turrets on their own, so let's see if we can get rid of these. These boys here. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely bloody beautiful, that. All right, um, let's try this one next. Beeper, hold fire. Very good. Kind of hate that I can't do the targeting from the pawn itself and have to do it from the mortar, but oh well. How about this one? Bloody beautiful again, Beeper. Very good. Okay, uh, now that's just a mini blaster turret with 59 health. I mean, did I make, did I at some point make a sniper here? Because a sniper rifle can outrange the blaster, but I don't think I actually have one. No, I didn't make one, did I? Damn it, that would have been handy to clean these off. I really don't want to waste a, uh, really don't want to waste another mortar shell on that when I've still got multiple other problems to deal with. Oh no, that one's got a... I didn't realise this one's got a high shield. Alright, well that one's just there permanently then. Um, and I'll have to do the defoliator as well. I don't mind that though. Once I artillery that, these guys will run in and they should be... I mean, relatively easy to deal with. Relatively being, um... You know. Beeper, don't... Who's going to get there first? Is he going to mark it? Or is Beeper going to shoot? Oh. I think he managed to mark it first. We'll know soon. Wait, what are you even shooting at? Oh, Beeper, you silly sausage. Shoot that one. I hope this doesn't hit now, to be honest. Oh, of course. <laughs> Very good. Okay, well, they're not going to rush us right now. Good job, Beeper. Proud of you. Okay, um... Hmm. Right, so set that to hold fire. These guys... I'm just gonna kind of wander around. Hmm. Plin, plon. Yeah, the, the mechanoids defeated sound. Very triumphant. Oh, there's some steel in the wall here. If only there was some mod I could use that would let me mine all of it. Anyway, there's not, so it's fine. Uh, who is the main... Minor Orgasmatron. Orgasmatron, I have a job for you. A very special mission for you, Orgasmatron. Get out there, lad, and show that rock what for. Very slowly. Sorry, I have, a, I have like fatty throat right now because I because I had fish and chips. But that's probably why I'm so British as well. Um, oh, there's some components in the wall there too. Look at that. Um, a loud tool? No, that can't be. That doesn't exist. There's no such mod. I, I would have known about it already. If there were a mod that let me do that, I would have heard about it. So I can only assume that there's no such mod. Oh, thank you, Saucy Jack. For your very rude... Very rude donation. Uh, message. I'm not British. Come on now. And at Christmas. The Shapes mod? No, that can't exist. Someone would have already told me. If there were a mod that let you select all of the ore in a vein, someone would have told me about it by now, so you guys must be lying. 
All the steel. Fire get it. Kiss me, Hazor. Shut up and kiss me. No, I'm not going to do that. Oh god, Beeper is just sat there at the mortar right now. Um, you wouldn't enjoy being kissed by me at the moment anyway. I have... My moustache is, is a bit too long. It's, it's, it's creeping into my mouth. It's, frankly, it's disgusting. I should do something about that. If only... A hair removal company would sponsor me so I could do something about it. But no. No such company exists. Orgasmatron, well, are you gonna go mine that now? Yes, you are. Good lad. Good lad! This stuff's hard to mine. Bro's about to get sponsored by Manscaped. I mean, I've done a Mansca Manscaped sponsor before. You'd know that if you were a real fan. What are you, a fake fan? They were very easy to work with. That's all I'll say. Come on, Orgasmatron. You can do this. I believe in you. This is thrilling content, right, guys? This is what you come here for. You come here to see a robot just go to town on this wall. Slowly. Anything could be happening on the map right now. Anything! Is Manscaped good for circumcision? You could try. I don't think legally I can tell you to try, but you could. All right, come on. Come on. Let's go. Very good. Now haul it all home. Good boy, Orgasmatron. Good boy. You earned your lubricant today. ground penetrating scanner yes very good um what next all right let me think about that in a second orgasmatron you aren't allowed outside anymore it was but a momentary freedom did i solve the issue of grinder not drinking lubricant i have no idea but he has some Uh, right, research, yeah. Um, do we need any of the other factory stuff? Artillery foundry? Ooh. Chem fuel clarifier. I think you pop meat, yeah, you pop corpses into there and... Hmm. Oh, I researched mechanoid. Mechanite restoration as well. Why did I do that? Oh, well, this is... It's a good idea. Don't don't knock it. I'll get advanced power sources so I can replace this with a with a good one. Um Oh, a fresh batch. Very good. Fresh pot <laughs> Sorry. Uh right, so we have some small quantity of steel and components now. Um a measly 80 steel. What we need to do is factory, factory, factory. We need a automatic drill, which costs 450 steel. Hmm, that's going to be a problem. And then that needs to feed into a steel extractor, which also costs 450 steel. 
So we have enough mechanoid components to make that and solve our steel problems permanently. Um, and... Uh, the ground penetrating scanner costs 150 and then a deep drill is 100, so I guess I just need, like, some steel. Just need some steel. I do need to deal with this thing as well. Um, let's, let's uh, throw some shells at it. I've only got three shells left, though. But I need to make these robots attack me. So let's see if I can make these robots attack me by uh, sending Bob out to do some uh, send Bob out to, to scope out the problem, as it were. If only there were enemies that could be salvaged into steel. If only, but such a thing just doesn't exist. Does not exist. There's no such thing. Um, right. No, don't, don't peep them. Peep these. Wait, that's too close. Too close, Bob. Too close. Sorry, I did you like that, Bob. I didn't mean to. Wait, is he in range? Oh, Bob, Bob, Bob. What's the range on this? Oh, Jesus, it's infinite. Uh... Okay, Bob. Can you by any chance binocular that guy from there? <laughs> I know I'm asking a lot. Can you see him, Bob? Okay, Bob cannot see him. Nah, they're all they're all behind cover. I think I'm just gonna have to raw dog this artillery. Yeah, okay. Let's just let's let's raw dog it. Never know. Might get lucky. Um, no, I don't know who Dreamy Ball is. I mean, that that was a hit. Kind of. It wasn't a good one, but it was a hit. Come on, Beeper, more! Oh, this one... No, that one wasn't so good. I don't think this is going to do it, Beeper, unless you can really pull a... pull a corker out of the... Uh, Huh? No. Nope. I think if he hurts them enough, they'll rush the base, right? But oh, he has another. Oh, we had more shells. That's where all of our steel went. I see. I see. I wish I didn't see, but I see. <laughs> now I know. Don't make any more of those, and cancel the ones you started. Okay, well, there's 110 steel that I didn't know we had. Hey, look, got one of the Militors. Oh, absolutely beamed him. Jesus Christ, Beeper, no mercy whatsoever. I mean, I targeted the ship, but, you know. So it wasn't necessarily a good shot. Yeah, I think that's going to be the last of the artillery. Right. Is that it? Oh no, he's got... Oh, he's got another two. Jesus. We had a lot more shells than I thought. You guys are talking about weird stuff in the chat, so I'm ignoring it. Yeah, that was a pretty good shot. These things are... These things are quite... Quite dead now. I, I wish they bled. <laughs> Why do robots not bleed, mummy? For they have no blood, son. They have only... Oil. 
and lubricant. Oil is lubricant. Uh, right. Um, Kenshi or Rimworld? They're two different games to compare. I can't, can't really. Uh, you know, you know what I mean. Right. Well, so a lot of those guys got hurt, but not, not a. Not enough. Not hurt enough. Um, we've got 190 steel. We need a bit more, so yeah, we're gonna have to deconstruct something. We got some steel over here. Oh, and some steel urns as well. I don't think it's called an urn if it's made of steel. Um, Bob? You're being granted freedom of movement again. Wow, everybody's saying biotech instead of ideology. I'm quite surprised. I would probably actually get ideology first. But hey oh, Maybe that's just the, uh, uh, the privilege of having them all already talking. Haul all of the steel, please, Bob. How much is that? And also, why can I hear gunfire? Is someone getting gunned down right now? Oh yeah, it's just a human. That's right, robot boys, get her! <laughs> yeah, that's right, Lynx, pull your knife out. I believe in you. Oh, right in the bean. Okay. You get what you get. And sometimes what you get is killed. Right, so that's gonna be, I think, enough steel to start scanning, etc. Sorry, I'm dealing with the fact that I ate chips about an hour ago. I'm still shooting. Was, did somebody arrive? Why was it still sh- Oh yeah, there was another- A person has a handheld mortar. And two reinforced- God damn. That's a shame. Just dropped it in the- Dropped it in the swamp as well. I think this is going to be moderately annoying that only tier 2 androids are going to be able to do ground penetrating scanning, but eh, it is what it is. Oh yes, the harvesting is good. We get some more nutraamine. At some point, I guess I'll probably s split the human production between, um... Oh, why was that one forbidden? Weird. Oh, probably because they were killed by, uh... Yeah, they were killed by... by human fighting. Um... Yeah, it's ground penetrating scanner, very good. Upset. <laughs> kind of upset I don't have the better ground penetrating scanning... scanner mod turned on, because... That makes this considerably faster. Uh, hmm. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna just real quick enable a mod, guys. Don't worry about it. It's okay when I do it. It's only annoying when you guys. Uh. It's only a problem when you guys make me do this. When I do it, it's fine. But now we have to wait for RimWorld to initialize again, which, as I'm sure many of you know, takes quite a long time. Let's read chat while I'm uh, while I'm doing it then. 
I re yes, I remember the rules that I give you an ad for restarting the game, but it, that doesn't count when I do it. You should play with chat-integrated mods like Charborg. No, I don't enjoy that. Um, he prays to Winston Church. No, Winston Church was a bit of a dickhead. Did I pray today? Why? Um, how many mods do I have? I mean, I'm subscribed to a lot of mods on Steam, but I don't usually run that many at a time. Not that you'd believe that, given how long my RimWorld is taking to initialize right now. I'm still ignoring you, thingamabob. Firejetic didn't stay inside, and that's why you asked me if I prayed today. Because the demons got to your head. Um, Stran enjoyed my videos so much that you went out and picked up all the DLCs. Yeah, I do need to email, uh, I need to email Tynan and ask him where my kickback is for all the copies I've sold. Tynan doesn't get emails on the yacht. Ah, uh, I think I know well enough that he is, in fact, checking his emails far more often than he should. All right, anyway. Back to it. And now we get to choose. I want steel, please. now considerably easier to maintain steel. <clears throat> We're going to be doing it differently relatively soon with the factory stuff, but, you know. Might as well do this too. Why not? What's the worst that could happen? I could destroy all of these for slag chunks as well, but um, I'm just not really that desperate. Also, I don't... Oh, I do have a furnace, actually. Maybe I am that desperate. I don't know yet whether I'm that desperate, to be honest. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. Wait, where's this going? What are you doing, Bob? Oh, he's making chem fuel. Okay, that's fine. We do need to keep a stock of chem fuel, so I don't mind some human meat going missing to facilitate that. I might actually spend a little bit of time uh, kind of modulating the temperatures as well, just to get more people more quick. Hmm. Nah, I can't be bothered. We just have to wait for scanning now for quite a long time. Um, because the first couple of steel nodes, they're going to be... There's going to be one here, and then there'll be one here, and then we'll probably get another one here, and then finally we'll get one somewhere that we can actually access right now. Something I will always love in YouTubers is when they genuinely have fun playing the games they do, says Will Sith. Yeah, I think you can generally tell, unless somebody's a very good actor, when the love is gone. That's why I uh, jump around games. <laughs> Toasty gamer, this guy deserves more than 342. Look, I mean, that's quite a lot of people. It's like two days till Christmas, man. People are with their families and stuff. I don't mind. There could be 20 people here and I'd be quite happy, honestly. But if you are here, don't forget to like the stream. And smash that subscribe button. Etc. 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 Hmm. 
Don't forget to sniff that like button's panties. It left him on the line. <clears throat> uh, right. Went very slightly off the rails there. How are we making so much power? Oh yeah, Helix again, right. I was curious as to how we were making so much power. Uh, is there anything I can do while I wait? <laughs> I'm, uh... Damn, I'm actually not gonna have enough steel for the... for the deep drill. Some steel must have been used for something, I don't know. Right, let's, uh, let's get creative here. Send out, um... Bob. To punch a tank for a very long time. Gothy spiders, why am I getting ads on a live stream? I think that they play now when you open the stream. There shouldn't be any randomly inserted, but I think when you start playing it, it gives you an ad. I don't know. Look, I get... We are, as YouTubers, <laughs> having some options taken away from us as to uh, where we can and where we can choose to have ads. I didn't previously have any adverts on my live streams. Um, but now people are saying when they join the stream and ad play? I don't know. Any tips to making a workshop? Yeah, you just uh, find the building you want and you just place it like that. It's like that. Nearly there, Bob. Nearly there. Talking Black Hole asks, Hey Hazel, when do you usually stream? Which is pretty impressive for a black hole. Um, I, I don't really have a schedule. Go, go, go. Come on, come on, come on. Go, Bob, go! Yes, I, I would typically stream on Sundays because that's just when most people are around to watch a stream. But, um... Oh, Aaron Strong, five dollars. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. I enjoy the streams that you do. I, I don't know if that. Okay. Uh, anyway. Very good. Good job, Bob. Um, let me just unrestrict you so that I can make a space to store those. Uh, dumping stockpile. I will just put them in here. Chunks. Oh, they're already in there. Why can't I get Bob to haul them then? Oh, because I, they're junk. I have to mark them for hauling. Can I get a Merry Rismus? I don't really know what that means. On account of me being an elderly man. But sure, Merry Christmas to you. Right, so how much steel actually comes from those? 15. Oh, also we scanned some steel. Where is it? All the way over there. That's actually achievable. Very good. Good job. Proud of you guys. The problem is going to be <laughs> getting power to it. Um, but I can do that with a battery to save having to run conduits all over the map. Although conduits honestly might be cheaper. I don't even have batteries researched. So if I were just to go, whoop, that is 90, it's like 126-ish. Batteries cost how much steel? All right, let's just quickly research batteries so I can find out. In the meantime, Bob, I have another assignment for you. Don't call myself an elderly man. I mean, there's benefits to being an elderly man. Siege? Oh, come on, you've got to be kidding. Where are they going to set up? This is annoying. Okay, looks like we're going to have to make some more shells. 
Unsuspend that and somebody do it quick, please. Rat Slayer? Yeah, whatever. Rat Slayer. You make some shells. How elderly are we talking? Uh, I'm 29. Twenty-nine. Who are you, koi fish? You're verified. Oh, wow. Crusader Kings videos, huh? I want to make a Crusader King video. Crusader Kings. Um, oh, of course you would put it there. That's so you guys. Foam shells. Smoke shells. Okay, I think we're safe. <laughs> they didn't bring anything actually explosive. Very good. Did we make those shells yet? Doesn't look like it. Come on, Rat Slayer. Yeah, the problem is I actually have, have never played Crusader Kings 3, so I'd first have to learn the game, and I worry that would take me quite a long time. So that's the only reason I haven't yet. learning the game for to a high enough level that I would feel like I can make something interesting with it. Yeah, you guys you guys go nuts with that stuff. Good job. You, you're doing great with your fire foam. I don't know why you're doing it, but you're doing great. Bob, uh, Bob, fine. Go and do whatever it is you gotta do, Bob. I mean, the shells do actually do damage when they land on things, but mainly they just make a mess. All right, we got some, uh, <laughs> we got some counter shells. Uh, let me just send Bob out here, I think. Caravan. Hey, I think this caravan will actually make it into the place as well. Unbelievable. Right, man the mortar. No, don't shoot. Bob, how you doing? You in range? Yes, Bob's in range. Okay, stand on the corner <laughs> and mark that mortar for me, Bob. Somebody just asked why I'm sending Bob out. It's because he's holding binoculars, which make this more accurate. Yep, they're just throwing fire foam and smoke at me, which is fine, I guess. If that's how they want to play. Wait, did I miss a shell? No. Alright. Oh, it's looking on target. I think we've got a good one here. Uh, Bob. Shit. Bob, run. <laughs> Ooh. Didn't do the trick, though. So I'm going to need you to do that again, Beeper, because they just found some HE. So I'm going to need you to do that again quite quickly, Beeper. Okay. They're assaulting. Good. Did they manage to get an HE into the base first? I'm not sure. I don't think they did. Oh, they did! It got Bob a little. He's okay. He's okay. Okay, stop your attack. Uh, wrench and numbers. Man the defenses. Probably don't need to send them here, but I'm going to anyway. That's lucky. <laughs> okay. Uh, how many of them even actually are there? One, two, three, four, yeah, you'll be absolutely fine here. And then I can steal some stuff from them. That's nice. That's always handy. Uh, how bad did Bob take it? Ah, he's alright. Yeah. 
God, they don't move fast, do they? Oh, they're going to run into this trader. Oh, for fuck's sake. Guys. Oh, hey, look, there's Lou the prostitute. Gordon's about to get absolutely deleted, yep. Yeah. Wow. He's, uh... This is an uninteresting fight. That dude's literally just called K. That's weird. Good job. Oh, hey, this is human meat! This is some good stuff. Is he out of range? No, he's not. Why aren't you shooting? Oh, because there's a stuff in the way. I'm gonna need you guys to get this dude. Is he bleeding out? Jesus, we're gonna destroy this limestone wall before we kill this guy. No, nope, I lied. We, he, we killed him. Okay, very good. And they killed only, almost all of the traders. <laughs> Boy, that's a lot of free pemmican. And human corpses. That's the stuff. That is the stuff. Any plans on playing more... Uh, playing Baldur's Gate 3? I did stream it, yeah, when it, uh, shortly after it came out. Um, I have just not really had the time set aside to get into it. Uh, oh, and they died while leaving. Very good. Uh, I would like to play it more. I enjoyed it well enough. Is this thing... Just... Is it? Why doesn't it show me a radius? Foliage kill radius 64. I mean, that's not the whole... <laughs> Should be about there. It's weird. Anyway, um... Yeah, lose a female, lose a, a female. Jesus, don't say female, come on. Um, are there any females around here? Um, uh, 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 sorry, I just <laughs> totally lost track of what I was thinking because of that. Uh, <laughs> I'm just, my brain, <laughs> my goddamn brain. Uh. <laughs> I literally can't think what I was even thinking before now. Oh yeah, Baldur's Gate. Um, I just haven't had the, um, uh, sort of, it's not that I haven't had the time. Wait, does this not count as abandoned? Um, yeah, I just haven't really had the, what, what's the word I'm looking for here? The gumption or something, the, I just haven't gone into it yet. I, I know I enjoy it, um, I just haven't, you know. Couldn't, couldn't honestly tell you why. Right, I need to adjust the zone for don't piss off the mechanoids. Uh, I need to basically have it like that, right? Yeah. Just just don't go to this like whole part of the map. Just don't even think about it. And then we'll be okay. Except for you, Grinder, who you live in the farm. And I'm just gonna make another save. Just in case something goes wrong. Has I got a brain jammer? Yeah, it's called I've played like 80 hours of Path of Exile in the last few weeks. Look at all this coom. Why did that guy just explode? What was that? Why does the base look like a gaming PC? Because it was built by human-like robots that, trying, that are trying to design something like a human would. They just don't know what they're doing. Uh, can we put corpses in these? We can. 
This is an interesting little little technique I think I've just found here. Grinder. Grinder. Can you Oh fantastic, we can pass him stuff through. That's very good. Uh I'm currently so this this league psionic mantis to answer the question any fun path of exile builds I'm trying. Um I've played what did I start with? Uh uh I did uh God, what was my first character? Oh yeah, I did a, a Rain of Arrows. I was like, I don't want to play Lightning Arrow or Tornado Shot, so I'm gonna do Rain of Arrows, be slightly different at least. Um, but I didn't, I didn't play it for that long, and then I, um, I played uh, ball lightning totems. The the ball lightning transfigured gem static. It's called a static where it just places one, and uh, that's pretty good on totems. Rise QT played it. I used to edit videos for him. Uh, and then I was like, man, this fucking sucks. So I went back to my ranger and swapped it over to Lightning Arrow and farmed some currency up to play a, uh, what I'm currently playing. Well, no, I also built, I, I also leveled a Righteous Fire character in the middle there and I was like, man, this fucking sucks. It's so slow. So, because my brain has just obviously been corrupted by, um, uh, the speed of the rangers. So I'm playing a, a corrupting fever build at the moment just to really bash through a load of currency to make some expensive dumb stuff. Anyway, okay, no more Path of Exile talk. Okay, some more Path of Exile talk, but not a lot. Yes, 9k plus HPRF is great, but this was like second or third character of the league. I didn't have a load of currency because I'm indecisive about things. So it was just a kind of crap Righteous Fire character that was not fun to play in any map tier past like five. Uh, right, anyway, so we don't have any more steel because Bob needs to go and melee attack that. Is there any good stuff in here? Quite a lot of this stuff is good, actually, as long as it's not tainted. Which it pretty much all is. How much is an explosive belt worth? Only 68 silver, whatever. Just let it rot, I don't care. I don't care. It's nice to be able to pass people through like that. Uh, some of them are getting butchered manually. But when they're butchered manually, they provide skin as well, so this is good. This is good. Okay, uh... Right. Bob, I need you to do that so I can build a very long cable. Why was that trader wearing a suicide belt? They weren't. That was from the raiders. The Tox Boys. How much is Pemmican worth? Quite a bit. I should probably sell all of that. Pemmican, pemmican, pemmican. It's very lightweight too. Hmm. Very good. Let's just load anything even remotely valuable into the frog. Where's that explosive belt? And why can't I load it into the frog? <laughs> mechanoid cluster, for fuck's sake! There's so many mechanoid clusters, what is going on in this this uh, colony? Alright, where's it landing? Oh, of course! <laughs> right next to us! Ah! Oh, goodness, what the fuck is that? Alright, everybody in. Everybody in. It's spitting! Everyone in! What is a carpenter? Oh, okay, well, to be fair, this is a shit mech cluster. But I do not know what this is. Okay, it is a 
lurching quadrupedal utility mechanoid with thick armor meant to absorb enemy fire while rapidly disassembling enemy fortifications. Ooh, I don't like the sound of that. So, did we make a PMO? Okay, well, I've got a load of Sabo, or Sabo, depending on your leaning. Okay, no, I did not start making AP yet. We should do that real quick. Uh, Bob? Okay, you're done, Bob. You don't need to do that anymore, but do bring these in with you, please. We're gonna need those. <laughs> In you get. Good lad. Uh, right, so yeah, this is a pretty easy mech cluster to just go and deal with. Aside from its dudes. Tesseron is... Uh, Tesserons can fucking... Well, you know. Uh, <laughs> Did we get anybody to make this? No. Silly sausage, I have a job for you. How flammable are these robots? I think they're about as flammable as a people. I don't actually know that, to be honest. It hasn't really been tested yet. But, uh... I'm just gonna guess about as flammable as people be. Okay, Mr. Wrench, grab some of that AP ammo. You're going to need it. Mr. Numbers, why have you put a burqa on? I gave you specific clothing. Why are you wearing a burqa? I made you armoured clothing. Alright, that's it. No more armoured clothing for you. Where is... Wear those flak pants, I guess. You don't care that they're tainted. Um, do you even have a backpack? Yeah, he's got a backpack. Just needs a... Something on Okay. Yeah, military jacket. Why not? There you go. You can't shoot good out of a burqa, Mr. Numbers. I just, look, I'm, I'm sorry if it's like a religious thing, but I need you to be able to shoot straight. And that's not going to work. Uh, put, put the, put the AP ammo in, please. Huh? Oh, he's carrying a load of. Wait, what? Pick, 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 pick the AP ammo up. Why'd you pick? Oh, whatever. <laughs> I'm not asking questions anymore. Whatever. Let's just uh, let's just make us make a save conspicuously called scum, and see what happens over here. AP is better than Sabo, so uh, oh yeah, I forgot that I even had this to be honest. Sabo does less damage, right? Um, so it does seven damage, forty-four and twenty-one versus the AP stuff, which if I could find, thank you. Does 9 damage, 12 and 34, so something like this has... To, I mean, to be fair, <laughs> that has a lot of armor. Uh, but like a pikeman is f better off just using AP. And for a tesseron, yeah, the same. Um, I was clicking on FMJ, not AP. No, come on now, you're lying to me. I clicked on this. AP. AP. There you go. Um, yeah, it, it's, uh, it does less damage, basically, Sabo. So as long as the AP can go through, you're better off just using AP. Uh, 
just uh, punch through that real quick, will ya? Oh, that's pissed him off. Oh, apparently I was clicking the wrong thing. Well, I don't know. I, I, I don't think I believe you, but whatever. It's fine. Okay, they're coming this way for some reason. I'm going to need you guys to merc this fucking Tesseron before it shoots. Okay, mission successful. They removed its arms. <laughs> and now that one. I believe in you. I mean, that wasn't too bad. Um, now, are you guys going to be able to... Uh-oh. That's never good. Okay, go get the Sabo. <laughs> Money, no. Thank you for money. I appreciate money. Um, what difficulty am I playing? I can't remember. <laughs> Honestly, I, I do not know. Okay, he's just gonna he's just gonna pr steadily work his way through my walls. That's seriously rude. Okay, well, did you get the sabo? Right, maybe this can... I for fuck's sake, man, come on! What is this? Okay, that does the trick. Fuck you! Oh shit, it's fighting back! I'm sorry! Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is annoying. This is where you get to see how little damage Sabo does. I mean, come on. No, not the hydroponics! <sighs> My guy, come on! <laughs> I need some bit. <laughs> I need some more damaging weaponry. <laughs> you don't even have anyone with you now, you're just doing that to be spiteful. Oh my god, oh, I didn't have the thingy turned on either. Alright, well, I'm just gonna have to... ...work from memory. Apparently I can't place that for some reason. Oh my goodness, why are they so annoying? Okay, actually, I'm gonna use this moment to vent, right? The reason these are so annoying is because they're placed kind of weirdly by, like, they have their, like, placement on the middle of a piece of it, right? So, like, you know, it always annoys me placing hydroponics and graves, especially. Graves are annoying. Somebody turn this into steel. Please. <laughs> I need it to feel good. Yeah, fucking turn, turn it into like 20 steel. Come on, go. Oh, that feels good. Hey, some plasteel came out of it as well. Now I need to make a new drug bench. Oh, I've actually, actually got one there. I'm not going to do that right now. Uh, don't forget about the rest of the... Oh, yeah. <laughs> How much armor do these things have? Pretty sure they don't have much. It doesn't matter anyway, I'm just going, I'm just going to beat it to death from within its um, firing range. Just punch that wall down. I know I could claim it and deconstruct it, but this is easier. I just click a button. I mean, honestly, that went pretty well, all things considered. And I did get most of the components back for the things destroyed, so... I can't complain too much. I mean, I guess you guys can shoot it if you want, if it would make you feel better. You should probably load... FMJ or something first. I could just leave these as the defensive structure, but I think it influences whether or not um, more events will happen, so I'd rather not. 
And I'll go punch this wall down next. Yes, hearing Mr. Numbers and Mr. Wrench punching through your solid steel wall would be terrifying if you were a human that was capable of feeling fear. That is gonna take aim here, isn't it? Is this gonna try and shoot? No, okay. You kill that. Punch it to death. Uh, meanwhile, you go in there, deal with this little one. Ah, no, wait, 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 I take it back. <laughs> No, not his framework! <laughs> What's he gonna do without his framework? Hey, you can't... Yeah, that's right. Oh, not his precious, precious framework. No, not the mech node. The turret. Silly Mr. Wrench. We got them, boys! Okay, uh... Yeah. Right, we can go back to don't piss off the mechanoids now, at least. How bad is it for Mr. Wrench? I mean, to be fair, this is just an opportunity for an upgrade, right? I can make him a better framework. I, I think. I don't fully know what the framework is. Uh, if I'm being completely honest. But it sure did get shot off. Whatever it is. Android T- oh, basic framework replacements, right, yeah, so... Well, I guess I'll make him a Guardian framework or something then. Make him, uh... Make him stronger, more powerful. He can become stronger than he once was. Okay, right. Let's, uh, let's address some things then. Right, now we can build our power. We have batteries now, but I don't want to spend the two components to do it. Um, primarily because I, uh, I do actually have two components. I was about to lie to you, I'm sorry. I didn't mean it. I need six of them for that. Uh, whatever, I'm just gonna run a power conduit. This is, this is easier. Something's shooting. Okay, it's just, it's just some visitors, no big deal. Oh god, they're actually doing it. It looks like these are running out of ammo. Oh yeah, look. <laughs> Go on, machine toe. Go on, son! Oh, he's given up. But okay, cool, good to- Oh, Gasmatron's wearing the burka now as well. I mean, fine, whatever. Or Gasmatron can wear the burka, I don't- No, he can't, because he's got a shotgun. And it- It's not good for shooting. Oh, actually, it doesn't have an effect on shooting. Oh, fine, whatever. You can wear a burka if you want. Alright, let's go. They've shot their last shot. We're free. We're free from the menace. Oh wait, not, not all of the menace, but some of it. Did Mr. Wrench just get shot again? No, he's good. They are trying though. We're all right. We're okay. How's Grinder? Uh, he's, he's, you know, he's keeping busy. Alright, you go deal with that. Very good. 
Very good. Proud of you boys. What are you scared of? Where's he fleeing from? Uh, I'm just going to force these guys to take the long way back. Okay, I think they were going to anyway. What's he, he going to... What's he doing? He's just being weird. Okay, whatever. Not my problem. Uh, haven't been able to figure it out how's Grinder killing the humans he grows. Uh, the room is the room is heated to like 50, 50 something C. It's just hot enough that the plants can still grow, even though they grow considerably slower. Um, and then it kills them when they when they hatch. Why do I have a very large hay grass field here? Can anybody remember why I would have done this? Why is that there? Did I do this knowingly? To level up Beeper, that's right, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm glad somebody... Uh, oh, perfect! Fucking headshot! Alright, all of this was wasted. Put that fucker there. Sorry, shouldn't shouldn't swear so much. YouTube is listening. Cancel the cancel the underground cable. Don't need it anymore. Uh So w what level did I need it? Did I need level 10? This was presumably to grow uh, Devil Strand, yeah. Okay, well, he's not that far off then, I guess. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Orgasmatron! <laughs> Orgasmatron. <laughs> Take the explosive belt off. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> no. <laughs> Bad. Alright, oh, oh, Jesus. Clear everybody's forced. No explosive belts. No burkas, because uh, nothing wrong with wearing a burka, but I need. I like to be able to see my robots uh, and their beautiful colors. Don't make the comments that I know you want to make. Don't just. Just keep them inside of your head. Okay, bot goods trader. Thankfully, coming to distract us from. Whatever the fuck was happening there. Um, buy our pemmican from us, for example. Uh, uh, now, I do need some advanced components, but I can just... I can just buy them. No, build them. I meant build them. Um, thermobaric fuel cells, Jesus. Uh, let's sell. Why do I have 168 dye? Let's sell a load of that. Apparently, past Hazor wanted to do some painting, but current Hazor is just like, I got problems, man. I got no time to paint. I got stuff to deal with. Uh, let's sell. Oh, my numpad is... Oh, yeah, I changed something. Okay, that's why. My numpad wasn't working as I expected it to. Uh, there you go. Every day's a good day when you paint. Oh, no, Ibex Ram 1. He's my favourite Ibex Ram. Right, anyway, now we have the deep drills should probably open this up uh yeah fuck it 
Stop saying sweary words, Hazor. Come on. Think of the ad revenue. Oh, yeah, I don't think the likes on live streams always automatically refresh, so. Yeah, let's just make another really conspicuous save named Scum and then uh, see what's inside here. I'm going to punch the wall out again. It's more fun. It's more fun to watch two robots punch a wall out. Do I have a, uh, no, I haven't played Battle Brothers, but I would like to. Oh, goodness, that's quite rough. <laughs> oh, this is a bad one, actually. I hope they get him. Oh, dear. Okay, let's, uh, let's, let's move. And kill that, kill that. Kill the cyber. What do you mean, can't hit target? Yes, you can. Oh, God. I knew I believed in you for a reason. Uh, guys, run, okay? If I were you, I would run. If you can at all run, then run. Luckily, yeah, they're not flammable, or at least they don't appear to be. Oh, no, I can't just run because the centipede. But that thing takes a really long time to kill. All right, kill kill the flamers if you can. What? Why did they just fire one shot? Oh, because I started reloading them. What was that? Orgasmatron, no! Okay, Orgasmatron is very much flammable. So is Mr. Wrench and Mr. Numbers. Well, I probably shouldn't have opened that wall, guys. What are you doing? You're not on fire anymore. You don't need to pretend you're on fire. Oh, that centipede's gonna be a real problem. Base defenses are gonna. Oh no! Wrench! Orgasmatron's just running around on fire up here. He's not so bad. No, don't. Oh, it's gonna go up to that bit of wall again, isn't it? How's this going? Uh, it's going about that well. Get, in, get into range, get into range. Nope, never mind. Oh dear. Well, it did set itself on fire. So at least there's that. Where's it going? It's got one particular wall in mind that it really wants to kill. Hmm. Who's he aiming at right now? Who's this guy? Wait, where, <laughs> where did this come from? Did he just randomly join? Ah, beans. Yeah, that's right, Raslayer. Rebuild that wall. Uh, if I were you, I would put that fire out. Th uh, yeah, if I were you, I would really put that fire out. That one in particular. What's pstink? What's persisting? What is happening right now? Why are they killing each other? I'm so confused! Why did one of them have a handheld Gatling gun? <laughs> okay, I mean... Ultimately, I think we are okay. I just need to find a way to deal with this stupid carpenter. Um, right, uh, Bob. Grab that. Rat Slayer. Put that fire out. You. Uh, oh, all the ammo exploded, of course. Bob, go get some of this Sabot. Sabo. Stop. Stop shooting me. Stop that. Stop EMPing me. That's really rude. Rat Slayer. Rat Slayer, I need you. I require your services. Rat Slayer. No. Oh, my goodness. It's okay. He's going to have to reload soon. Oh, God. 
Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Get on out, get on out, get on out, quick, quick, quick. Get up. Good lad. Right, uh, Bob. Did you, did you get the goods? He got the goods. Okay. Go over there and very slowly deal with this problem. Well, these turrets, please deal with this centipede. No, they got the big turret and the medium turrets burning down. And the medium turret's shooting FMJ, which probably... Oh no, it should be doing enough damage. Bob's slowly dealing with that. Beeper's dead! Oh, that's gonna be a problem for morale. Oh, this, uh, unfortunately, I think the centipede burner, burner, rather, is gonna be the one that sends us kind of over the, uh, the rimworldy edge here. Yeah, right, Slayer, put that fire. <laughs> oh, no. I really just need this this carpenter to die. That's my only, like, uh... Like, the, you know, I made a scum save just before this. I could, if I wanted to. But, um... I feel like you gotta let these things end sometimes. Although this might not be the end, you know. Bob can, can probably... Hang on. Open this and send Silly Sausage to go and open that while Bob's on the way. Bob might be able to do some do some pretty serious work here. Dev mode, run and hide for now. Oh, never mind. No, 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 there's a door. Gone. Oh, he knows we're out here. You gotta get him quick, Bob, but with the gun, preferably, Bob. Hey, no. That does have a minimum range, doesn't it? Yeah, okay. You're gonna need to stay inside of that minimum range, Bob. Whilst reloading somehow. Whilst the uh, big thing destroys our entire base. How fast can you reload? Mm. Hey, that's not in that range. <laughs> okay. I could have microed him in there, but uh yeah. Well the I this thing, I hate this thing. This thing's not okay. Did Bob survive? Uh hard to say. Grinder, I've got a mission for you. It's time to unleash. <laughs> Let's slip the dogs of war. You too, silly sausage. Special mission. No, is there just like a button for it? How does this work? <laughs> I don't get it. Is this when they die? <laughs> they don't... You can't just choose to detonate it? Rat Slayer's still alive? Yeah, but he's never getting up. Where'd it go? Wait, where is it? Oh, there it is. Hunting down the humans. Oh, Orgasmatron got up. Wow. I'm pretty surprised by that, honestly. There was a charge rifle on the ground there, I guess. One of the dudes picked it up. Yeah, go on, you guys. Beat the shit out of that thing. 
You got this. Some of those OP vehicles would have been... Yeah, they would have been pretty great everywhere. That's why I didn't make any of them. Oh. Oh, no. The robot I didn't know. I, did that... Seriously, did I just miss that robot just random joining? Like, where did... Where did ID956 come from? Oh, I told them to build more androids. That's where he came from. Oh, this is a problem. forgot that I uh, made them build more, that's all. Where was this indecision when you were slaying Bob, huh? Yeah, where, where was this level of indecision then? So Silly Sausage just got put down with, with two smacks to the legs. That's pretty disappointing, honestly. Orgasmatron is very slow moving now. Oh! There goes... There goes one of them. That did no damage. Well, guys. Oh, yeah, he might, he might be out of ammo. Yeah, I think he's out of ammo. Oh, that's, uh, that's a shame. I wish he had run out of ammo slightly earlier. Uh... Time for chronomancy? No, all, all things have to come to an end, and this is as good a place as any for this for this to end. So now this kind of just gets steadily disassembled. Caravan away? No, I don't. I don't want to save this. I don't want to save this one. This one's best left. Uh, best left as a as a as a death. How long have we actually been here? One hundred eighty-six days. That's not that many. It feels like the threat level was really high. I guess because these guys are, are, are like valuable or something. I don't know. We're hanging on to a lot of valuable stuff, so I suppose the big threats make sense. Like uh, one hundred and nine thousand silver. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Kind of wanted them all to... There you go. Good job. I want to be able to fast forward again so that I can watch this carpenter literally dis disassemble my entire base. There we go. They're going to get some roof collapses. If they're not careful, they're going to they're gonna hurt themselves. Oh, Orgasmatron's here. Come on, get him, Orgasmatron. Oh my god, he's so slow. He is so slow. Hit him in the eyes. Okay, you can't do that, apparently. Go on, punch him. Go, Orgasmatron. You may have been retired from the stream alerts, but that doesn't mean you have to give in. You maybe should though. Oh no, it's it's moving away. Oh. Oh yeah, now the combat music kicks in. That's Basalius right there. It's a bit late for that game. Why does it keep retreating? Go on, punch it. Punch him. Go on, Orgasmatron. Lock him into hand-to-hand -to -hand combat. Okay, this is... Go get the... Go get the carpenter instead, then. 
<laughs> this is tragic. This is actually sad to watch. And he's going away. Like, he just can't even get in to punch anyone. Yeah, go on. Go get him now. Go get him now. Go, 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 go. Go, go, quick, quick. You're gonna have to move faster than that. Ah, oh, damn, okay, let's just, uh... Where's Ryan Slayer? Where is he? Not anymore, he ain't. <laughs> Bam, they're all dead. Oh, no, they're all dead. Damn, what a shame. We tried as hard as we could, but they're all dead. And now this thing's going to slowly disassemble the, the entire base, brick by brick. And it's going to make a honk every single time a roof collapses. Well, thank you for, uh, thank you for hanging around. Mr. Numbers is alive. Oh, okay, we can, we can change that. change that right quick. <laughs> oh no, game did not like that. This is our dude coming to save us. But no, yeah, that that's going to be that. That was uh this was actually a really fun colony. Um I I, I kind of knew it was going to end at some point because the just endless stream of mechanoids was was horrific and I could not um couldn't quite advance armor and weaponry fast enough to, to deal with them all. Getting kind of trapped inside and not having access to steel was a... was a problem. So... These things can literally die in a hole. Um... Uh, what are we doing next? Um, I've got one more piece of content for you guys around Christmas. Um, most of you probably won't watch it because it's not RimWorld. <laughs> uh, and then in the new year, we'll we'll make some more fun stuff. But I'm I'm kind of taking things easy at the moment, you know, having an actual holiday break. I'm not not working, but I'm not working super hard. I hope you guys all have a good time. Spend some time with people that matter or don't matter, as the case may be. And if nothing else, I hope you um, have a good time. I don't know. Enjoy. Merry Crimblus, etc. Rest in peace deeper. Gone too soon. The 80 by 256 millimeter fuel shell incendiary. This 80 by 256 millimeter fuel shell incendiary shattered beeper's neck, left leg, right leg, and thorax viciously. Rest in peace. Merry Christmas, beeper. Merry Christmas. Where's the end stream button? I've lost the stream page. Guys, I've lost the stream page. I think I'm just forced to stream forever now. Oh, there it is. All right. Bye-bye. Have fun. Cheers. Mm -hmm.